So my name is Kate Humble, and uh, today I am a historian, but I started off uh, my career as an actor. And William Shakespeare has been part of my life since um, basically my first words. My mother was an English teacher, and uh, Shakespeare has been in my house forever. Uh, and when I decided to go into the theater for a living, I developed a, a real passion specifically for the globe and what, uh, what was done there. And when I was a teenager, they opened the new globe. Uh, in 1997, I went to the inaugural year of the Globe Theatre in London. I think I was 16 at the time, and it blew my mind. The show they were doing was Henry V, which is probably my favorite. But the reason I really liked this rendition of it was because the man they had playing Henry V, usually there's a real switch between the, um, the Henry they portray and Henry IV, both parts. This, the kind of timid, um, very philosophical character, and then he turns into this great warlord, all of a sudden, with very little transition in Henry V. And the way they chose to do it was by far the most evocative decision anyone has ever made, because they brought the Harry from Henry IV and made him Henry V. And so you saw the contrast between um, the kind of nervous, unsure young man who was performing for his troops at the Battle of Ashencourt. And I remember sitting there watching the show and feeling something inside of me kind of melting. Something was connecting the continuity between the plays and the connection with the historical figure, even though it is really propaganda uh, by any sense of the um, imagination. It didn't matter at the time. It didn't matter that it was propaganda because it was beautiful. 